Garp spoke to him in Glasgow and started by asking the 20-year-old how he's feeling after completing the big move. Uh, I'm just so happy. Uh, I'm very proud to be a part of a club like this and um, like I said, I'm just so pleased and happy to be here and uh, can't, wait, can't wait to get started. When you think about the fact, Tom, that you know, two years ago you were playing amateur football, you're now standing in these surrounds wearing such a famous football shirt, how does it all sit with you? Uh, it's it's a pretty good feeling. I mean, when you put it like that, it sounds quite bizarre and, I guess, in a way, unheard of. So, um, to be here now, like you said, after um, playing local league, I guess you could say, two, <coughs> two years ago, it's uh, been a uh, been a very good journey and one that I'm just so happy to be a part of here now. You had some firm bids and genuine interest from some big Premier League clubs. Why have you chosen Celtic? Uh, I think... From all the speculation, the interest that I had, um, this felt right from the start. And um, I mean, the decision at the end of the day is down to me. I've got a lot of advice from uh, a lot of people who've helped me in my career. Um, but from the moment I got here, uh, from the vibes and uh, feedback I got back from the coaches and the the playing here, uh, the players here, it just felt so right, and I'm just really happy to be here. What about the standard and the quality in the squad? How much of a jump is it from the A League? Yeah, it's been a massive step up to what I'm used to so far and that's only in training so I'm sure it'll be bigger in the games and um, one that is certainly a step up but nothing I don't think I won't be able to handle so uh, it might, may take me a little time to adjust but um, yeah, hopefully I'll get used to it pretty fast and uh, get on the pitch. The big news is you've been registered for the Champions League squad which means you're a chance to play in those massive ties coming up against Juventus. If you let your mind dream a bit and think about featuring in those monumental Football match? Yeah, I think it can set big goals. Um, it's obviously a massive occasion, and uh, I believe it's out of my hands. I mean, I'll obviously do everything I can on the pitch to be a part of those games and be a part of the squad. But I think coming here so soon, it might be it might be a little bit too soon for me. But let's hope not. <laughs> Neil Lennon has spoken glowingly about you in the press conference we just had. I mean, how much confidence has he given you? What has he said to you about the role he wants you to play in the first game? Yeah, he's given me a lot of good feedback as well and I think um, he wants to help me progress and develop as a player. Um, so um, I guess he, he obviously knows my strengths and weaknesses and um, probably knows how, how to use me best in my best position. So I think uh, the sooner I can get into into the first team, the better. But uh, I mean, obviously come with a lot of hard work and, and maybe a bit of time. There's a couple of Aussies that have been here in the past. Scott McDonald is highly regarded and of course Mark Baduka really made a name for himself at this football club. Are you keen to carry on the legacy of Australians here at Celtic in a big way? Yeah, of course. The, the two people you named have obviously had great great careers here at Celtic and uh, achieved great things. So to, to I guess, uh, emulate what they have done and um, copy their success that they've had here is, is definitely a goal of mine and uh, one that I hope I'm able to do. Just finally, Tom, when do you think you'll be able to break into the first team? Uh, hopefully sooner rather than later, but it's it's obviously a good squad and uh, a massive club, so it might take me a bit of time, but uh, I hope to be there uh, within the next couple of weeks. Fantastic. Well, the whole of Australia is uh, watching you closely, following you closely, and very proud of you. Congratulations on the move and all the best. Thank you very much. Tom Rogic there, new Celtic signing. We'll get back to cricket now and part-time 